Welcome back, Enthusiasts. This is Axelon. We are continuing our playthrough of Season 1, Episode 1 of The Walking Dead, A New Day. We're about to enter the pharmacy at long, long last, after killing many zombies along the way to get here. Oh, we no. use the key! We gotta hurry. That is like a very, very loud, very obnoxious dinner bell. Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly-dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. I got doors not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Hey, Lee. If you don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. <laughs> I love that option. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know that. Are you sure? Shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, man. Come in time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Hey. No. Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing. Wait. The window is screwed. Go. I like this minimal interface. It makes it more cinematic. I found something. Kate and the store one last time. <laughs> to me, the choice here is obvious. We have a guy good with tech stuff in the zombie apocalypse, and we have a good shot with a gun. This, this is what I was talking about earlier. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today, especially a good friend. And I was talking about the the one difference between Kenny and Larry. That Larry is. Even more pragmatic than Kenny is. Even though we saved his life. And, 
at great risk to ourselves, you know, you still willing to kill us. Meanwhile, inland, Atlanta's been downgraded temporarily to an eight, with attacks and rioting being reported in all three things. Citizens are currently advised to stay in their homes. Rioting? Is that what they're calling this? Rioting? I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Find your friends. Be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup. And I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. If they go from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did? Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. I don't know if you guys can hear this, but Duck is currently raving about some kind of like superhero or something. But his dialogue is repeating. <laughs> I I've heard something about a super laser like three times already. It's, it was the same sentence over and over and over again. Underwater mega laser, excuse me. Poor Clementine. That's that's all I can say. Poor. Not only is she stuck with, with Duck, but Duck is just repeating himself over and over and over and over and over again. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. You'll be alright. Yeah. Definitely. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I thought you needed the help. Ah, 
That makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. was toast but you know what he wasn't oh and then hey duck uh, you want to cool it for a minute okay sorry better be torturing poor clementine with I'm your sorry, underwater I'm mega laser squidious shark story no, it's not that it's i got grabbed again i was there though i fell and my walkie-talkie broke glenn had the other one oh i'm sorry Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. <sighs> Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Clementine. Ah, uh, poor girl. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But well, if anything happens well, I know to where you daughter, live. or that little girl you've got with you... <laughs> you watch your ass. So there. Now walk away. Hey, Lee. Do you have a second? You know what? I'm gonna go talk to her. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. Yes, he would. That guy Doug is dead because of me. Oh, he's not. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor in's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Had to say something, didn't you? Had to say that. This is this is one thing I don't like about the game is that it's it's set up like a like an actual televised be series. Fun the walkers. Never but they'd stop us out. I know some people are perfectly okay I with this. I want you to have this, fine. okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. But you don't know me. Anymore. I always I'm really try to we gotta ignore get these as much as possible. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. I We're feel from like Saint it can John taint it's beautiful. I never did your thank you for saving Duck from the expectations of, of characters. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. And Yeah, see, it's, I don't know, I just, I just think it could mess with how it affects your decisions as opposed to if you just went in blind. Uh, th that's just me, I think, personally. You know, you should, you should go into these types of games blind, have no preconceived notions of characters. Either right or wrong, because as we all know, trailers sometimes lie to the audience. Um... So let's look at our choices compared to everyone else. 
Honesty. You and 63% of players were honest with Herschel. Who would you say if Duck you and 49% of players chose Duck? Okay, I mean, I don't like Duck. But Sean was run over with a tractor. I mean, yeah. Plus, like I said, it was pretty obvious he was going to be the one who died. Because he, he was showing way too much common sense. You can't have that in The Walking Dead or any zombie thing. Because if there's too much common sense going around, nothing exciting happens. Just Just survival. That's what happens. Survival happens. Ah, you and 48% of players defended King. Really? I'm in the minority. It's a close minority, but I'm in the minority on siding with Kenny? Really? Against, with some guy who I just met? Against the guy who gave us a lift? You and 45% of players gave it. I can understand that. Uh, again, like back in my last video, I talked about how you know, maybe she goes psycho or something. I, I can perfectly understand that. Who would you say? Doug or Carly? You and 76% of players chose Carly. Again, I feel that choice is fairly obvious. Uh, Carly is just a more useful person to the group. Doug, Doug is a funny guy. But you need a bit more than just Huber to survive. And we all know Carly is a very good shot with that gun of hers. I also wish I could skip the credits. I'm not going to here for the sake of recording. But, uh, yeah, I wish these were... I mean, you can... Um, Hit exit game at this point by just you know you just go to the menu exit game or main menu excuse me and then you could continue to the next episode afterwards but uh, yeah just a simple press space to skip would have been nice same thing for the trailer that would have been nice uh, but yeah that was season one episode one of the Walking Dead. Um, if you haven't played it yet, I highly advise picking it up. I've seen it on sale many a time. Uh, it's a great experience. E even someone like me who really, really doesn't really care for uh, the zombie apocalypse type scenario, I, I found this game to be fantastic. Uh, the character of Lee Everett is one of the better protagonists I've seen in a video game in a very, very long time. Uh, I think he's great, he looks great, he sounds great. Uh, Clementine, awesome character. They created a, a child character that is not annoying. Unfortunately, um, any annoy or most of the annoying factor that Clementine could have had was instead channeled into Duck. And so we, so we have Duck, who feels the annoying kid capacity. Uh, well, I'll talk more a bit, bit more about the characters as we continue, but that is for another time. This is Axelon from Enthusiax. If you guys have liked what you've seen so far, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, we've got more videos on here, you know, feel free to comment. If you want to see more of this stuff, visit us at Enthusiax.com. Lots of fun stuff there. I will see you guys next time.